am doing a weight loss progress video. I haven't done one of these in almost two months, I think it has been. And it's definitely time for me, for, for me to show you guys how I have been going and how my body is looking now seven months on since starting my weight loss journey. So I watched my first weight loss video today and oh my god guys, I actually was sad for myself because I'm not longer, no longer that person I used to be seven months ago. I've completely changed, my body has completely changed, my mindset has changed, everything has changed and I'm so happy for it and I'm so glad I decided to start eating healthier and looking after myself more and just feeling better about myself. Like I feel so much happier and so much more confident than I've ever felt before. Even when I was super, super, super fit before Frederick, I feel so much more confident than I was when I was so tiny back then and so fit. I just feel so much happier now and I know that you guys can tell that, especially in this video and all my other videos that I do, you guys can tell how much happier I have been lately just because I've been feeling really good about myself and I need to tell you guys why and show you guys why. So basically I've been doing this weight loss thing for seven months now. I started in January this year. And I was 79 kilos. I'm currently weighing, I think, 70, 70, 71 between those. Um, but I have toned down a lot um, in the last couple of months. I think I have toned up quite a bit, which is probably why I'm still in the 70s and not under. Which I totally don't mind because I feel like I'm like 62. Like, I feel tiny. So my weight has definitely changed. I will do measurements for you guys so you can... So I can hopefully get back my measurements from my last video because I threw it out my book for some reason. And I can compare with you guys how much um, centimetres I have lost off my body and then I'll go weigh myself. And then I'll show myself what my body looks like. So I'm going to go get my measuring tape and measure myself very quickly. Apparently I actually haven't thrown out my book so I'm going to go through my book and do the measurements. Okay, so I've got my first measurement. So I've got my measurements here and I'm going to just do them. So the first one I did was my bust, which my boobs have definitely shrunken. Oh yeah, so <laughs> in January my bust was 100 and now it is 93. So next was hips and my hips were 110. My hips now are 106. Next were my arms and they were 33. So my arms now are 30. My thighs were um, 67. My thighs now are 60 centimeters. Oh my God. And last but not least, my stomach was 98. This is gonna be the shocker guys. My stomach's 84. <laughs> I honestly can't believe how many centimeters I have lost off my body in the last seven months, guys. It's unbelievably amazing how much I have lost off my body. So we're going to quickly weigh myself and then I'm gonna show you what my body looks like in the same clothes that I wore seven months ago. This is what I look like now, seven months later. I know from here, Frederick, he's a pregnant, but we have to deal with him. So this is what I look like in the same clothes seven months later. It is, it is crazy how much this has changed. I know in the before, or like the seven months ago thing, my pants were a lot lower, but that was because I couldn't get them any higher. So now I can actually wear them high-waisted. I'm so happy with this. So this is my frontal, this is side on, this is behind, this is my other side, and yeah that's my entire body guys, I can't, I can't believe I look like this, honestly, I'm so 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 happy with how I look. <laughs> I'm so happy. 
pop that down so you guys can see my face. Anyway, my camera is just about to die, so I'm going to get going. So I hope you all enjoyed seeing how my body looks. I'm so extremely happy, guys. I'm so, so, so happy, and I can't believe I've done this and I've made myself extremely happy. Um, I do have to say thank you to everyone who gives me so many amazing compliments. Um, you, it means so much to me that you guys can notice my weight loss and how happy I am and everything like that. I just want to say if you want to lose weight and feel good about yourself, just do it. Go for it because if you push it, you'll wish that you did it earlier. So just do it. Anyway guys, I'm going to get going. I'm going to put my normal clothes back on and ready to go stuff my face with yummy, yummy, yummy food. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, if you're not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! I'm Christina Person. I'm 28. I have a nine-year-old daughter and I just underwent bariatric surgery, gastric sleeve, in 2017. My surgeon is Dr. Kipnis and the surgery was performed at Jersey Shore University Medical Center. I was just very overweight. I would work out, go to the gym, I would go for walks. I tried little diets. I found out by seeing all my specialists that I had an underactive thyroid. One day I go to the store and I just saw my reflection and I just noticed myself. I was like, I don't know you. That's not who you are. What made me decide to go for the bariatric surgery with Dr. Kipnis is seeing one of my friends who were also obese go for the bariatric surgery. I seen her results and I was influenced and also inspired to go and consult with him. I felt care and I felt compassion. I felt educated. Since the surgery, I've lost over 150 pounds. I try to maintain a good healthy weight. What I love to do with my daughter is we like to go to the theme park. Um, I tend to drag her like I'm a teenager myself. She sees a different person. She's very excited. It's brought us closer together because I'm more active. It's been a great, great journey and I feel that it would be an amazing experience for anyone who's looking for this outlet. Is that you, Mama Jun? The Here Comes Honey Boo Boo star recently underwent a major transformation, which she's been mostly keeping under wraps until now. The full scope of the reality TV star's weight loss was revealed on a March 31st episode of WeTV's Mama Jun, from Not to Hot, which centered around a photo shoot. In a clip from the episode, which the network shared on Instagram, June Shannon looks trim in a magenta top and black pants whilst peeking on camera. She's also depicted walking with her back to the camera through what appears to be a studio while wearing a belted blush dress with ruffles and a sheer skirt. I've worked my A off working out, eating healthy, and now it's like everything is coming full circle and I'm becoming the person on the outside that I felt like I was on the inside, she says. On April 1st, WeTV returned to Instagram to share a shot from the photo shoot that the March 31st episode of the show chronicled. The network split up the picture into nine separate posts, which they shared one at a time to create a photo grid on their page depicting June in the same pink dress. This is not an hash April Fool's joke, the network wrote in the caption of each post, which they've since deleted. Worth have also posted a side-by-side -side on Twitter showing off June's new look. Additionally, the network shared a preview of next week's season finale of Mama June, from Not De Hot. The clip shows the mother of four rocking a long red gown while crashing ex-husband Sugar Bear's wedding. And while she clearly looks fabulous, all does not go according to plan. The reality TV star who once weighed 460 pounds and has undergone multiple surgeries as part of her weight loss journey, has slimmed down from a size 28 to a size 4. She has attributed her ex's nuptials as the primary driving force behind her desire to lose weight. My goal when I first started this weight loss journey was to make Sugar Bear kind of jealous, she once said on the show.
but it's no longer about revenge. Doing all the surgeries really took a toll on me not just physically, but emotionally.